Hi, I'm Peter Glassford. I'm a coach with smartathlete.ca and I'm here to show you the proper way to bunny hop. The key to a proper bunny hop is to lift the front wheel first. We want to lead with the front wheel. We want to use that rear wheel to lever the front wheel off the ground and then let that front wheel lead as we come down on the other side of the log or the rock or whatever we're doing. The mistake people make, often because we're clipped in, is that they lift everything at the same time, hopping like a bunny, and often end up hitting that rear wheel because everything comes down at the same time. So today we're going to use a couple progressions to get you to that beautiful front wheel first bunny hop. For our level one log hop, we're really going to focus on using our position that we've practiced a lot, that aggressive position, that elbows out, I even like to sometimes think knees out. You know, we're getting nice and low, we're attacking into that obstacle, and we're just going to practice rolling over things and trying to not run into the log or into the rock or whatever it is, and we're going to try and just let our weight transfer. So not lifting, just using that aggressive position and being very light, letting the wheels come up and over the obstacle. Our level two log hop is basically just our wheelie. So we're in our same aggressive position, we're going to come into the obstacle, we're going to go just a tiny bit of a sort of little mini squat and then we're going to think about pulling, shifting our hips back and keeping our arms strong to lift that front wheel and then as it comes down we're just going to let that rear wheel roll over the obstacle. So this is just a wheelie so you can practice the wheelie in a field without the log and then get really good at completely clearing that log. So level three, this is where we're going to add the rear wheel lift. And this one we have to be careful with because we're going to have to execute that same wheel lift. And then as we come down, we're not doing a, a big donkey kick. We're not doing a front flip. We're going to keep in our aggressive position. We're just going to push our arms forward, push that front wheel into the ground. And then we're also just going to lift our legs a little bit. So I like to think about this sort of motion. And that's going to give us that nice boom and then push to get over, OK? Level four is my favorite level. This will get you over massive logs. You don't even really need to worry about the bunny hop because level four is going to get us up and over big, big things. This can be rocks, logs, and basically all we're going to do is that same thing we did in level three, that front wheel, rear wheel lift. Just now we have to do it really fast, tapping the top of the log and then pushing that bike forward. Okay, so we're here and then we're in our attack position and we're going to push that bike, keeping our head up. Mistake people make, they drop their head and start doing a front flip. So head up, really quick, bouncing that bike over the log. Level five is the exact same again as level four, except what we're gonna do is, rather than waiting to tap the log, we're gonna wait for that front wheel to get to its highest point. I'm not touching the log. And then basically we're gonna use that same push to clear that whole log and ride away. So still front wheel first, lofting that with the same hips back and then when we're at our highest point jumping that front wheel forward so pushing that front wheel forward it's that same pushing the front wheel forward and that's our bunny hop that's what we've been waiting for